what's up everybody just another day um i actually got my mountain bike today on the uh the hill behind my house so um let me try to make it down this um like usual it's pretty uh pretty slippery pretty rocky uh nice view you got the mountains in the back of the snow hopefully you guys can see that on the camera it's a really nice view a really nice day actually um i got my brother over here he just got a a new bike it's first um i guess you can say actually mountain bike it's a hard tail but you know it's still a mountain bike it's just like mine so um he's got a giant talon so we're gonna go check out these little hills back here there's a few little jumps Let's see what i can record or whatever um and we're gonna make it down back the hill and my brother has to take off and go to work so let's get this going I just put those rocks there for the quad. Go up there and go to the left. All right, everybody, we are at, not the top, we're at like the middle. Um, like I said, we're limited on time, so I actually shot a video right here uh, a couple years back. It was pretty fun, so we're gonna smash down this trail. It's my brother's first time actually being on a mountain bike in a really, really, really long time, so we're gonna try to get what we can. Um, here's my uh, my valley. This is all Hemet, San Jacinto, Val Vistas by the mountains. That's the Idlewild where I do my other videos, so we check it out. Uh, there's never water here, so that just tells you we've had a lot of rain lately. So let's get this started. <laughs> oh, geez. Don't go too fast. All right, everybody, we are now at Home Depot. I am buying some wood for the ladder bridge I'm gonna build outside my backyard. Um, I have a few two by fours and some other little bit of wood. And later I have to finish my little firewood build uh, with the sheet of wood. I have to get my measurement. So uh, I'll show you guys the trail when we get home. And then I'll show you what I got started and what I'm going to try to work on. I'm going to try to get this ladder bridge jump up there, which should actually be really fun. I'm really looking forward to that. So uh, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hello everybody, welcome back to my vlog. This is uh, continued to the next day. Um, I'm actually working on uh, some mountain biking stuff right now. Um, a little, uh, let's just say, uh, complicated. Uh, I'm doing this by myself. It's a lot more work than you actually expected it to be when you're by yourself. Usually, you know, people have their friends to help them, so on. But either way, let's just uh, let's start with where I'm at right now. So I actually have a straight jump or a kicker, however you're gonna hit it. Um, this might be a little bit beyond my uh, my skill level, but you gotta learn. You know, I, I'm trying to, you know, I, I want to race. Um, racing is not necessarily all the jumps and stuff, but you know, you gotta start somewhere, so, and I have this out in my backyard. Not my property, but not someone else's personally other than a school district, so I doubt they're gonna do anything with it. So, just hope that it stays here for a while. So let's show you how this looks. Um, it'll be a little bit easier one, a little bit more for uh, beginners. You know, if you hit it this way, you can't really screw up unless if you just kind of float to the side a little bit. That's where the shovel kind of separates where you should be going. Um, you can kick it off to the right, which is very easy. It's just a very small drop. Um, this is actually where my bridge, uh, my bridge drop was going to be. Um, 
it was gonna go straight down right here, but that's kind of a short run. Like you can see how short that was. So what I did was uh, I had a nice big ass jump right here, big to my terms. Um, it was gonna be a you know straight shot. We can kick it over, but instead I put in this uh, pretty big uh, drop. Um, it's not done. I actually don't have any more wood. I started just using what I could around the house. Obviously not enough. So um, I'll show you from the top right here how it actually looks. This is the top. This is where I've gone so far. I haven't really figured out how I'm gonna get the trails to come down yet. Um, but either way, it's gonna conform. It's gonna break into these two spots right here. So you got these two options, or you got the the ladder drop, the wooden drop right here, which everything looks not the same on camera. You guys should all know that. Just type it in on on, on YouTube. Um, GoPro versus uh, actually what it looks like from the eye. It's completely different for those that actually know and actually ride mountain bikes. And I feel for you guys when I see some of these videos. I know what you're really going through. Trust me. Trust me. I have a hard tail, so I know everything that's the difference. So I'm about 5'6". Uh, so just a just the base of this drop is about three feet to where you're actually gonna land minimum of where you're gonna land you'll be about the top so you can tell that that's about you know five and a half feet right there so it's gonna be a pretty big drop for my hard tail but uh, my truck actually uh, it actually holds up through everything I've been through and if it breaks something I still have a warranty for the next couple months so I kind of should use it um, I'm not going to do the ladder drop right now. I'm going to try to hit these two little jumps. Um, see if I can get it going. Let me get my tripod out here. Have my wife help me real quick. My shoulder's been sore, but my, my wrist and my shoulder actually. My wrist has been killing me. It's hard for me to even carry wood up here. My shoulder. Um, whatever. You know, let's just see what we could do. So, you know, let's get this going in a few minutes. I just wanted to do a quick little uh, to finish up the uh the vlog from the other day and uh so uh that's what it looks like so far i don't think you guys can really see my jumps right there they're not really big then again i said i'm not i'm not an expert but uh i'm in the progress so let's see what we can do All right, everybody, that sums it up for me here. Um, so that's just a trial run, that's a test run. Obviously, I only had a few feet of running space to hit the, the jumps. I'll admit, I really didn't clear it, but it was just kind of a downhill slope, so there's really no um, uh, ramp I have to clear over anyway. So either way, it's just hit or miss, it don't really matter. Uh, I don't know if you can really see it way up there, how well you can see it on camera, but it actually looks pretty freaking big the the ladder drop does so um i'm actually going to maybe tomorrow work on it my wife says as soon as i get home from work i'm gonna go keep hitting those jumps so um she really wants me to do that and then with the uh the ladder drop she says that she don't think i'll do it but <laughs> i don't know we'll see so uh but the dirt actually feels really soft my since my bike's a hardtail, I don't have that rear, the rear shock, so, but it actually feels really soft to land, so that's really good, uh, good comfort, especially since my, my, you know, my arm and my shoulder's been kind of, uh, killing me lately, but, uh, we'll, we'll see what happens, and then, uh, that'll be, that'll be the next vlog, so, uh, this is from today and the other day, so, I'm gonna finish this one up, get some posts for you guys right now, and then, uh, we'll see what's going on from there, and, uh, hopefully I get, uh, probably gonna build these jumps up a little bit bigger, because, uh, aren't too happy with them right now and just with no running space it's just not getting that speed and that just it's, it's slippery so when I first start I can't start out just hauling ass so we'll, we'll get that going so uh, I will see you guys next time thank you for watching and you guys have a good night